Hello Scorpio, this is Cupid's advice for you for the month of June 2016. Atmosphere of the month, you've got King of Pentacles. Uh, what can help you, what can um, help you to make your love life better, Queen of Swords and what can bring you some difficulties, it's a Major Arcana, the Fool. Well, in the first place, all cards are like um, uh, two, it's court cards and uh, full, it's major kind of, but anyways, it's a person, it looks like a person. So, uh, when we see court card or person on the card, it can be actual person. So, when I see king of pentacles as atmosphere, for some of you, it can be a uh, an earth sign like a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn, male or female in general reading and it can be a lot of things in your personal life. Maybe uh, you have interest for this person, maybe this person have interest uh, for you, maybe you will be interacting a lot with this person and somehow it will affect your love life. What else? King of Pentacles as atmosphere. It's a good atmosphere, atmosphere of success, uh, being grounded, feeling good, enjoying life, getting some money. Because King of Pentacles, he really like uh, even he holding Pentacle, not only money he likes, he love to enjoy life to do something for his health, body, uh, beauty, outlook and enjoy life, food, sex, everything that is feeding our body and makes us happy, healthy. Uh, so it's a really good atmosphere. Uh, what can help you? Queen of Swords and what can bring you difficulties? The Fool for coupled. Queen of Swords can be because what can help you or who can help you. For me, Queen of Swords uh, more like Libra, but uh, in general reading, maybe it's any air sign like Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Maybe this person can help you in somehow in your life, but as uh, your own traits, Queen of Swords, someone who is very logical, wise, she see people, situation, she's very rational and she is very concrete. Sometimes she makes really tough decisions but they are necessary. Uh, so sometimes that's why she looks like a, I'm sorry, bitch. Uh, because she's so cold, she's so straight, saying what she's thinking just into your eyes and uh, sometimes it's unpleasant but somehow it can help you. But swords, it's also intellect and uh, uh, how we're talking, dialogue I would say. So communicating, uh, being logical, use your intellect in their relationships and don't get uh, because full staying in the position what can uh, bring you uh, problems don't get excited don't act unpredictable like I am here I am there I am all over and nowhere don't be like this also fool that is staying in position what can bring you difficulties maybe it's somebody's way of action maybe someone will act unpredictable uh, foolish uh, someone who wants something new wants some adventure uh, going somewhere because uh, without thinking what the consequences of this action will be so maybe it's somebody but you also have to watch out so you will not be acting like this don't be too um, 
because this fool and queen of swords we have to compare them fool is someone who is open who is naive who is really um, there is no fear in him uh, he trusts like everybody you know because uh, it's like pure soul uh, naive soul someone who is not so experienced actually queen of swords is someone who went through uh, a lot of difficult stuff in her life that's why she is really good in evaluating situations people and he will not trust anybody he will check him or her first I don't know why you've got this energy but you have to be a little bit more logical not so emotional not so um, excited about some something on somebody say what you think see people who they are and say it to them if if there is something that you don't like just say it say your own truth um, for singles I know that people don't like it when I'm saying it but you know uh, it's only for one month full its new beginning it's start of something new like jumping into new relationships but it's staying in position uh -uh. it's not good this month maybe because this mass going retrograde and uh, if you will jump into something new if you will start and even if you will be very optimistic about these relationships maybe it will not uh, be for too long these relationships so this month maybe it's better to be by yourself analyze what you want what type of partner you want what type of people you're attracting how you want to live your life, what you're going to do, and stuff like that. Because Queen of Swords, she is by herself. But anyways, you can talk to people, meet new people. Uh, Queen of Swords, she is with a good sense of humor, actually. But she's not taking uh, relationships serious. And she will definitely not jump into something like losing her head she will be communicating flirting but taking it uh, easy she will uh, like if you you can say like test a person who she who she just met through communication by the way through communication she will tease him a little bit, her, him or her, doesn't matter. And uh, through jokes, through communication, through teasing, she will try to see who he or she is. And fool, trust everybody, starting something new, want something new. Too spontaneous this uh, fool she will think first so uh, dear Scorpio this month you have to be more logical for some reason say your own truth evaluate people don't allow anybody to fool you and if you feel like I want to do something unpredictable stop yourself <laughs> But you have a great atmosphere of the month, so enjoy life, take care of yourself, I'm wishing you love and abundance and hope to see you soon.